In numerical analysis and computational fluid dynamics, Godinov's scheme is a conservative numerical scheme, suggested by S. K. Godinov in 1959, for solving partial differential equations. One can think of this method as a conservative finite volume method which solves exact, or approximate Riemann problems at each inter-cell boundary. In its basic form, Godinov's method is first-order accurate in both space, and time, yet can be used as a base scheme for developing higher-order methods. Topic. Basic scheme Following the classical finite volume method framework, we seek to track a finite set of discrete unknowns Q I N equals 1 delta x x i minus 1 2 x i plus 1 2 q t n x d x Display style q underscore i caret n equals frac one delta x int underscore x underscore i minus one half caret x underscore i plus one half q t caret n x dx, where the x i minus one two equals x low plus i minus 1 2 delta x display style x underscore i minus 1 half equals x underscore text low plus left i minus 1 half right delta x and t n equals n delta t display style t caret n equals n delta t Form a discrete set of points for the hyperbolic problem Q T plus F Q X equals zero. Display style Q underscore T plus F Q underscore X equals zero. If we integrate the hyperbolic problem over a control volume X I minus 1 2 x i plus 1 2 display style x underscore i minus 1 half x underscore i plus 1 half we obtain a method of lines mole formulation for the spatial cell averages t q i t equals minus 1 delta x f q t x i plus 1 2 minus f q t x i minus 1 2 Display style FRAC partial partial T Q underscore I T equals FRAC one delta x left F Q T x underscore I plus one half F Q T x underscore I minus one half right which is a classical description of the first order upwinded finite volume method C F Levique finite volume methods for hyperbolic problems Exact time integration of the above formula from time t equals t n display style t equals t caret n to time t equals t n plus one display style t equals t caret n plus one yields the exact update formula. Q I N plus one equals Q I 
n minus 1 delta x t n t n plus 1 f q t x i plus 1 2 minus f q t x i minus 1 2 d t Display style q underscore i caret n plus one equals q underscore i caret n frac one delta x int underscore t caret n caret t caret n plus one left f q t x underscore i plus one half f q t x underscore i minus one half right d t. Godinov's method replaces the time integral of each t n t n plus 1 f q t x i minus 1 2 d t Display style int underscore t caret n caret t caret n plus 1 f q t x underscore i minus 1 half d t with a forward Euler method which yields a fully discrete update formula for each of the unknowns. Q I N display style Q underscore I caret N That is, we approximate the integrals with T N T N plus 1 F Q T x i minus 1 2 d t approximately equals delta t f q i minus 1 n q i n Display style int underscore t caret n caret t caret n plus one f q t x underscore i minus one half d t approximately delta t f caret down arrow left q underscore i one caret n q underscore i caret n right, where f q l q r Display style f caret down arrow left q underscore l q underscore r right is an approximation to the exact solution of the Riemann problem. For consistency, one assumes that f q l q r equals f q l if q l equals q r display style f caret down arrow q underscore l q underscore r equals f q underscore l quad text if quad q underscore l equals q underscore r and that f display style f caret down arrow is increasing in the first argument and decreasing in the second argument for scalar problems where f q greater than 0 display style f q greater than 0 one can use the simple upwind scheme which defines f q l q r equals f q l Display style f caret down arrow q underscore l q underscore r equals f q underscore l. The full Godinov scheme requires the definition of an approximate or an exact Riemann solver, but in its most basic form, is given by q i n plus one equals q i 
N minus lambda F carrot I plus one two N minus F carrot I minus one two N lambda equals delta T delta X F carrot I minus one two N equals F Q I minus one N Q I N Display style q underscore i carrot n plus one equals q underscore i carrot n lambda left hat f underscore i plus one half carrot n hat f underscore i minus one half carrot n right quad lambda equals frac delta t delta x quad hat f underscore i minus one half carrot n equals f carrot down arrow left q underscore i one carrot n q underscore i carrot n right Topic: Linear problem. In the case of a linear problem where f q equals a q, display style f q equals a q, and without loss of generality, we'll assume that a greater than zero, display style a greater than zero. The upwinded Godinov method yields Q I N plus one equals Q I N minus new Q I N minus Q I minus one N New equals a delta t delta x display style q underscore i caret n plus one equals q underscore i caret n new left q underscore i caret n q underscore i one caret n right quad new equals a frac delta t delta x which yields the classical first order upwinded finite volume scheme whose stability requires new equals a delta t delta x 1 display style new equals left a frac delta t delta x right leq 1 Topic: Three-step algorithm. Following Hirsch, the scheme involves three distinct steps to obtain the solution at t equals n plus one delta t. Display style t equals n plus one delta t. From the known solution at t equals n delta t display style t equals n delta t as follows step 1 define piecewise constant approximation of the solution at t equals n plus 1 delta t display style t equals n plus 1 delta t since the piecewise constant approximation is an average of the solution over the cell of size delta x display style delta x the spatial error is of order delta x display style delta x and hence the resulting scheme will be first order accurate in space 
Note that this approximation corresponds to a finite volume method representation whereby the discrete values represent averages of the state variables over the cells. Exact relations for the averaged cell values can be obtained from the integral conservation laws. Step 2 Obtain the solution for the local Riemann problem at the cell interfaces. This is the only physical step of the whole procedure. The discontinuities at the interfaces are resolved in a superposition of waves satisfying locally the conservation equations. The original Godinov method is based upon the exact solution of the Riemann problems. However, approximate solutions can be applied as an alternative. Step 3 Average the state variables after a time interval. Delta T Display style Delta T the state variables obtained after step 2 are averaged over each cell defining a new piecewise constant approximation resulting from the wave propagation during the time interval delta t display style delta t to be consistent the time interval delta t display style delta t should be limited such that the waves emanating from an interface do not interact with waves created at the adjacent interfaces Otherwise the situation inside a cell would be influenced by interacting Riemann problems. This leads to the CFL condition, a max, delta t delta x, 2, display style, a underscore, max, delta t where, a max, display style, a underscore, max, is the maximum wave speed obtained from the cell eigenvalues of the local Jacobian matrix. The first and third steps are solely of a numerical nature and can be considered as a projection stage, independent of the second, physical step, the evolution stage. Therefore, they can be modified without influencing the physical input, for instance by replacing the piecewise constant approximation by a piecewise linear variation inside each cell, leading to the definition of second-order space accurate schemes, such as the MUSCL scheme. Topic. See also Godinov's theorem High resolution scheme Lax Friedrichs method MUSCL scheme Sergei K. Godinov Total variation diminishing Lax Wendriff theorem AUSM <laughs>